Okay, honey, can we jump into a relationship question, please? Okay. A person has presented in my life a compliment who my heart says could become an amazingly fun marriage of the heart. This per person is currently thousands of miles away on a very unique journey. I have no idea if and when our paths will cross again. Even so, some of the changes happening in my life stream appear to be related to this person. And I feel his presence in my space. I see the eyes. I feel so embraced. And I feel supported and loved in ways I never have before, with no physical contact or communication. I'd like to feel confident that the changes I'm walking through are unique, uniquely for me, that I'm not being swayed by some Hollywood romantic ideal of waiting for my true love to return. The situation looks so much like The Princess Bride. I wonder if I have put myself so much into that movie that it has, it has actually come true in my life. And if that's the case, how do I step out of the control and to be free, let myself embrace the gifts and love the universe is clearly presenting? The funnest way to dance here. Here you are. Here is the dear one. None of this in between here has anything to do with space or time. But there's a beautiful unfoldment going on. As the heart levels are coming together. And merging. But you see, where you're at here, and this is for everyone here. That's why I wanted to jump into this when I was tuning into it. This right here we'll call an unfoldment. Now, this is where it becomes so, what, what do we call it overrated? Because we're gonna have this unfolding. We're gonna have that unfolding. We're gonna have this dynamic. We're gonna have that dynamic. We're going to have this moving out. We're going to have that moving out. The only thing that does, if we're going to give any answer, meaning, whatever, however, the only thing we're going to call this is a prep oration or metamorphosis. But most importantly, most, 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 most importantly for all concerned here is getting rid of this and getting rid of that. Why, why, why is it made back into a me? Why is it made, made, made back into a him? Why is it made into an egoic dance? You see, when I make it into a me, we're once again playing with a lot of egoic hopla. We're also playing with a lot of woes. Make that an E. We're playing with a lot of me and you and yada 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 stuff. It turns into a lot of head games. Head games that has nothing to do with prepared, uh, preparedness, has nothing to do with metamorphosis, has nothing to do with purifications, has nothing to do with two heart levels moving together, because the heart and the head have nothing to do in, with each other, has nothing to do with all of these priceless unfoldments to run forth. This right here has everything to do with a box of, uh, a heart box of chocolates for Valentine's Day with a lot of high hopes of roses and all this fun stuff. And I should be treated this way, that way, that way, and this way, all this head stuff going on that equals a lot of conflicts automatically. Even the space here, the space that what we'll call a 
a metamor metaphoric time continuum. Why don't we just call it all dyslexic and dyslexia? Okay, because that's the only thing we're playing with here. A lot of false sense of egoic constructs that make everything so confusing and conflicting. So what we're really playing with is how fast can I push a dear one away? Because how can I control how I can make this work and how can this dear brother control? How can we force it to work? Whatever happened to, why don't we just let it work? Or why don't we more so say, why don't we just let it come to life? Why don't we just let it take on its own life? Why don't we both let all of this other stuff, situations, scenarios, even dear brothers that have been in our live streams that have gone different directions, that we've also outgrown scenarios, situations, dynamics, that we don't need do anything with or about. Why don't we even let that be moved out on its own? Let's not even plan on it. Let's not even get involved in it. Why don't, what if, what if, and why don't we let all of that run its course? As we really, literally, specifically let everything else come to life. And wow, I, I really mean it with every particle of my being. How best can we assist and have a blast together?